Hey there, so I've picked up a nice little tip here and it's about TubeBuddy. Um, so if you're looking to become uh, good with your uh, your YouTube channel, this might be helpful for you. Um, TubeBuddy is going to talk a lot about, and I don't know all of it yet, but it talks a lot about SEO and how to get your um, video to be viewed, you know, to get more views on your videos on YouTube. So as you can see here, it's just a Google extension. And so all you have to do is go here and um, look for TubeBuddy, right? And when you go to TubeBuddy official site, um, it will have you go ahead and install it or, you know, allow the extension for the for Chrome, which is what I did. I allowed the extension for Chrome. Then you refresh your YouTube page and there it is. And it's like, what do you do with this thing? Okay, so let's take a look here. I want to show you because this is actually what I worked on today and learned to master. Um, I noticed, you know, like I did okay with the title words in the description because I usually just copy and paste my title into my description. Um, I picked that up somewhere over along the way. But this specifically, now we've got tags in the title. Tag Tags in the title and description, tags and description, total tag characters. I was like, what does that all mean? So I just figured it out and I want to go ahead and show that to you. Um, so I'm going to edit this video and we're going to watch how the, uh, the score goes up. And I'm actually going to remove that. That's weird. It disappeared. I wanted to remove that hashtag that I put on here, um, but it has disappeared now. And some of the things that it's telling me, let's look at it over here. Let's talk about the ta the tags in title and description. So if I go down here and I have these tags, I have certain tags in here. I want these tags to also appear up here. So this is my OutSchool application video, which I do have a tag right here, OutSchool application video. So I'm not sure why it's not picking that up, uh, but let's let's um, leave that for now and make sure that we have it down here. So here you can see that it's not actually in that particular tag. So I want to, I can, I can creatively put this in here like this. Hi, Mrs. D is back again with my personal out school application video. Okay. And now I've included the tag in my title and in my description. So that's good. That's what we want. Then let's take a look at tags in description. I only have five of 20. So let's take a look here to see what those are. So I have out school application video. Now that's in there. Out school application, out school teacher, out school work from home and stay at home mom. So let's see if we can include these in here. Um, and we can add that right here. Out school is great for stay at home moms. Stay at home moms. If you want to work at home. Let's see what else did we have down here for the tags. Work from home. Um, and let's just or just love to teach, become an out school teacher today. Okay, so now I've included that out school teacher tag in here as well. Um, and let's see. And I can also put here, I will help you with your out school application. Just contact me. Okay, good. So, and then I'll use my Grammarly to fix any of these right here. We want to keep that as mum because that's what's actually down here. And now the other thing that I want to do is go here and think about as many things as I can to put some more tags in here. 
that is what is called your, um, this is probably where most people struggle, total tag characters. You get like 600 total tag characters. So you want to um, see as many as you can. ESL, online teaching, um, let's tag Q Kids because I work for Q Kids, Q Kids, Q Kids teacher, um, Q Kids, what, what came up here? We don't, Eh, Q kids teaching. We don't want to put too many Q kids tags in here because that's not the focus of this. Um, so let's go and look at out school teacher. Um, oh, good. There was a good one. I'll leave out school teacher on there. Oops, it's already there. So you don't want to double them up. Um, out. There was a good one. Out school uh, application video. I have that on there. What was it? Out school referral that's it out school referral out school referral link you want to add as many as you can think of to get those um, those those scores these um, two buddy scores up higher so let's see what else can we think of um, teaching online I don't think that that's on there teaching online jobs from home, stay, and then I'm going to put this because it's in there. I want to make sure that it's correct. Stay at home mom. We're going to put that in there. Um, we can put stay at home mom, and then I can change it to be American because I put that in there for the tag earlier. So let's change that to be Oh, it, let's remove that. Uh, mom. Okay. And let's see how to make a good video. That might be a good tag. How to make a good application video. We'll tag that in there anyways. I don't know how many people are searching for that, but you can also check the score by double clicking this. When you double click it, it brings up your TubeBuddy. And here you're gonna see this is something excellent because there's a little bit of competition, but not a lot. So this is going to make your video, if somebody searches this, it's going to make it come up in your in the search engine uh, higher on the list. So that's good. We want that. Um, let's take a look at some of the other ones so I can show you what that looks like. The OutSchool application video. That one looks like it's fair because everybody's applying to OutSchool right now. So that alone is not going to get my video to come up in the search engine. So that's not going to be a great one. Just keep that in mind, okay? And then let's see. Let's click one more just for fun. Let's click the stay at home mom. That probably isn't going to be a great one either. Yeah, because lots of people look for that. They, and so what's going to make my video with my 388 subscribers? I love you all. Thank you so much. Um, but what's going to make my video with my little bit of subscribers pop up to the top of the list? It's not that because there's going to be other people with way more views and way more subscribers than that that are going to pop up there. So um, that's not the great one. But there are a couple of really good ones on here. So now that I've added tags here, I've tried to put them up here in the description. And in this description, oh, let's put an S on that and then add that tag here. Stay at home moms. Oh, and let's do just for the fun of it, stay at home home dad, right? Because dads can teach too. Okay, so I've added them here. I've added some of, the, some of them in here um, and these tags. So let's go ahead and save that and take a look at what that SEO score does now. Gonna go to view on YouTube. I like to just close in education, that. choice matters. Sorry about the state ad. certified teachers at K twelve powered private schools Still provide a high teacher. standard. Haven't made it big yet. It's not famous, so we've only gone up fifty points. So I'm a little disappointed with that because I feel like I could do better, right? And I think this is one of the reasons. It's not quite the same um, tag. So let's fix that. And I don't. It's still not showing up here. So I'm just gonna delete it. Mrs. D's out school application video. 
Okay. So down here, I'm also going to put Mrs. D. That is going to help that score go up. Mrs. D. And I like to put Teacher D too because some people do search me that way. And I can't believe I forgot to put those in there. But there you go. So let's put that in here. Um, Mrs. D. And I'm going to put also known as Teacher D is back. Okay, so, oops, Teacher D is back. So that we're matching more and more of these, right? So let's see how that affected my score. And you guys are along with me for a little experiment. I'll try not to leave this going for too long, but let's take a look now. And we can see I've gone up to 70. So we're doing good. We're making progress. Now, title words in description, title words in the description, and I've still got this hashtag here, even though I've erased it. I don't know what to do to get rid of that now. So that is going to be a problem here. I don't know why that's coming out. Let's just change this all together to out school application video. brought to you by <laughs> Mrs. D. And I'm just, I'm really just trying to get these to match up because I think that's what's wrong with my score right now is that I've got that hashtag in there. That was dumb of me, right? Thinking I'm on Twitter. All right. And let's check and see if that took. There we go. So do you see that SEO score? That's up to 100 now because I've done all of these things to the video. Now the other thing that you are going to want to do is you're going to try to get a high resolution thumbnail, info card added, end screen added, comment pinned. I don't, let's see, do I have a comment? I do have a comment pinned here. I'm not sure why it's not checking that and it's also hearted. I haven't added chapters. That's where like you split it up and say at this minute you can see this and at this minute you can see this. I haven't done that yet because like I said, I'm just, you know, getting into this. But um, so there you go. That is a really useful tool that's going to help you out and I hope that this video helps you and I'll see you next time.